We have work by William Zorak. He was born in Lithuania and came to the United States in the 1890s as a four-year-old child. He was known for carving pieces directly into wood or stone. And we have this example here of his own cat, and it's carved out of what we call Tennessee marble. There's an identical version in the Metropolitan Museum of Art that's gray and carved in granite. The surface is really nice, it's smooth, and I think it's a great example of a sort of simplified forms that we find in the 20th century modernist movement. And he has a sort of presence and a regal quality that reminds me of the kinds of uh, cats that you see in Egyptian tombs. Through the skill and artistic craftsmanship of Zorak, he was able to show that figure that was lurking inside of this block of marble. Here's a little piece in bronze. We have this wonderful, wonderful depiction of a sleeping dog. It's very compact. Sometimes people don't even see what the figure is. It looks like it might have been a, a found object, like a piece of stone, that all he had to do was you know, make a few little incised lines to come up with the uh, figure itself.